good afternoon. I made a mistake in my typing up of the Bible for today's readings. I only realized it afterwards. <laughs> I'm uploading it now. But I'll, I'll have to redo it all over again. I've left quite a lot out. <laughs> That's the first mistake I've made. I must have been very tired. <laughs> Sorry about that if anyone's going to listen. It's not, it's not as it should be, but I'll correct it. Not today. I'm going to um, be doing healing prayers for every day. I'm going to do a prayer of St. Richard of Chichester from my very, very ancient prayer book. It's falling to bits, but I like this prayer. For design, divine assistance. May the strength of God guide me this day, and may his power preserve me. May the wisdom of God instruct me. The eye of God watch over me. The ear of God hear me. The word of God give sweetness to my speech. The hand of God defend me. And may I follow the way of God. Christ be with me. Christ before me. Christ be after me, Christ within me. Christ beneath me, Christ above me. Christ at my right hand, Christ at my left. Christ in the fort, Christ in the chariot. Christ in the ship, Christ in the heart of every man who thinks of me. Christ in the mouth of every man who speaks to me. Christ in every eye that sees me. Christ in every ear that hears me. And those who are Irish know that that's St. Patrick's breastplate. And yes, I've had this prayer book since it was signed by the author. <laughs> that one, <laughs> it's signed by Michael Buckley himself. Janet Wormsley, Love and Peace, Michael Buckley, 25th of 6th, 1995. And I've used this all the time. It's all falling to bits. I've used it since um, I had it in, 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 um, in Jamaica. It's, it's never left me. It's all in bits, but I can still make out and still can read it. So I like that prayer and I thought I would do that today. And today is the 31st of January, 2021, so tomorrow is the 1st of February. This is from Matthew 15, 26, 28. And Jesus said, It is not right to take the children's bread and throw it to the dogs. The Canaanite woman replied, Yes, Lord, but even the dogs eat the scraps that fall from their master's table. He said, Woman, you have great faith. Your request is granted. From that hour, her daughter was healed. The reflection, Jesus healed because of his love, compassion and mercy. And because the woman asked, God granted what her heart desired, healing for her child. Do we have the certainty of the woman when we ask to be healed of our afflictions? The prayer, Lord, please come into the areas of my life that need healing, especially my lack of faith in you. Amen. Yeah, the beautiful reading today. Thank you for listening. And I'll sort out the Bible mistakes tomorrow. <laughs>